Hello everyone, this is Shadow Dragon back on the DC Universe online test server to continue our streak of seasonal rewards. Um, actually, you could probably consider December as the beginning of the streak because we get that break in November. So, uh, from December, it's pretty much going to be non stop for almost the first half of the year. So, um, we're kicking it off with the holiday event. And we're going to check the feats before we go to the vendor to make sure they don't do anything um, too outrageous. Uh, usually the things I want to look for is that there is no collection because we, we don't want uh, RNG to be part of this. Uh, and we don't want um, base item checklists that make us pick up items that we don't want. Um, Alright, so typically, uh, I think the new pattern is there are three feats. Uh, so there's a holiday wreath accessory. Um, this usually replaces what used to be like the collection to get, like either an accessory or some kind of style item. So now we straight up buy it, uh, which is cool because, you know, I'm going to be grinding marks anyway and you're taking out the RNG from this um, and then there's a style so it looks like the three holiday sweaters uh, sometimes the styles go together sometimes um, they're all the same part and the base items I don't know I, I don't like this checklist thing that that we've now had for two seasonals in a row um, they kinda did it correct for a couple of years where you could get like 10 of anything um, but I guess the the plus side of this is it's just five items it's not not too hard to keep track of but um, yeah the bad thing is we're just gonna be spending like I'm sure not everyone wants all five of these items um, electric Santa chair explosive gift Santa trap Shazam holiday tree snow covered cobblestone wall Okay, so that's a look at the three feats, uh, one star each, and we'll head over to the vendor. Okay, so as expected, the, the single item is 100. Um, that's typically what it was. Um, just as a reminder, in the old version, you would have to get, you know, like nine collection items randomly, buy the last one for 100, and then get the style item. So this, this format is way better. Uh, the the sort of quote unquote set uh, style item is 50 a piece for three. Again, not too bad. I mean, this used to be like full armor set or like partial, close to full armor set, which would probably be close to 150. So the the base items are kind of pricey, but there's only five and we have to get all five so here we go uh, I would actually prefer these to be like lower and then the, the feet should be not a checklist it should be like out of ten or something like you get ten of any of these um, so yeah, I would still prefer that, even though the list is small. Um, Santa electric chair. That's kind of weird. <laughs> um, Shazam holiday tree is kind of expected, because we have holiday trees for the other heroes, and he has been, he has been highlighted recently, so... <clears throat> About time he got his own tree. I'm sure like next year we'll probably get a Black Adam one or something. Um, snow covered cobblestone wall. Uh, I kind of expected this to be taller. Like uh, I thought it was going to be a reskin of like the Halloween one. Uh, but it's kind of nice to have a, a low one as well. Can be used as a divider. Uh, depending on how big it is, of course. Um, this would be the one item that you'd want to get a lot of. Uh, fortunately, that's not the 25. Um, 
See, this is where it would be an advantage to have these like 10 and then you get a collect 10 for the feet instead of checklists because you know you might want to get like five of these or something. Um, Santa trap. The, these all seem like anti Christmas things actually. <laughs> uh, explosive gift. All right, so we'll take a look at these in the base. All right, so we're going to start out with the style items. And the accessory is a holiday wreath. So this is kind of what I expected it to be. Just a floating wreath either to the center or it's to off to one side. Um, the interesting thing though is it it seems to be an object that has its own aura because it's got the snowflakes coming down and when you run around it leaves a trail, a, a slow trail of confetti. So that's the cool part about this. And then let's move on to the sweaters. We haven't had new sweaters in a while. take the material off. So the preview looked a little bit blurry so we're gonna have to zoom in. Okay that's pretty detailed. So that looks like it's fixed colors. Okay, so that cleared up. Uh, that was probably just some lag. Um, all right, let's change around these and see if anything appears. Okay, so not, none of this is tintable. It's just a fixed um, ugly sweater for Batman. And it's also nice how they named the set. Uh, holiday sweater dash and then uh, this the the character because that way they're all in one place so this is a similar sweater but just with Harley's head and then the Joker So the Joker one is purple and green. Let's go back to Harley for a second. And uh, just gonna remove some of the other items so it's just the sweater. Okay, so that, that's it for styles. That's pretty simple. It's just three sweaters and an accessory. Okay, so now we're going to place the base items so we can get an idea of scale.
Um, they didn't give us a League Hall Holiday Tree for Shazam, though. So it's, it's too bad we won't have that as, you know, part of the set of the ones we already have. Okay, that, that's a nice looking wall. Perfect for snowball fights. Okay. Yeah, the, the wall is definitely my favorite item. Interactive. Okay. Whoa, that is a huge explosion. It, it actually does damage too to the owner. <laughs> All right, let's get these items back. Okay, which other of these are interactive? Because th this was only 15 and it was interactive. Okay, the tree is normal. The electric chair is interactive. Yeah, it's just animated. So the chair doesn't do any damage because we can't sit. <laughs> and the trap. If you look closely, it's got some Joker cookies. Um, the trap is not interactive, though. So it's just the bomb. It should be interesting to see what happens, like, if you place this in uh, a league hall and then you do, like, the duo or, or one of the alerts. <laughs> Alright, so that is it for Christmas 2022. It's pretty simple, pretty simple set. But uh, I'll do another video if they add other stuff. Um, but I, I kind of think that's going to be it. So um, stay tuned for more videos and thanks for watching.